Hi, this is the man from Modesto. I've been praying over the last few weeks to receive some dreams to share information on YouTube uh, to encourage people to look and see that the Holy Spirit is alive and the Holy Spirit is able to show people who are following Him uh, what things are going to happen, uh, how things are going to be. So I've been praying for some messages to share on YouTube and uh, the Lord has sent me uh, three dreams and this is the second one and it's called Two Bad Presidents. In this dream, the Holy Spirit showed me that this is what will happen if Barack Obama becomes president and this is what will happen if John McCain becomes president. And what I saw in the first section was uh, Barack Obama and he had some folders like this, except they weren't these basic uh, file folders. They were the ones that you get when you go to school in the new school year. They always sell them in the store for 19 cents or 39 cents. And they have, uh, I think Mead Co Company makes them and they have like a football player on there and a basketball player. I'm sure everybody knows the ones I'm talking about. So what he was doing basically was, it was like a kind of a, some kind of a, a surface in front of him and he was taking those folders and he was putting them and making tents like this. And he made nine of them completely and then he also put in uh, some panels on some other ones and in one case it was like a little foundation like maybe just the very edge of one of these was set up. And I understood that each one of those tents represented some kind of law or action that he put in place that was part and parcel to the New World Order system. That he was setting up all of these uh, rules or systems or who knows, government offices, I don't know what each one represented, but they, but they were part of the agenda for the New World Order. That's what he was setting up. And then I saw McCain, and he had the exact same folders, and he was doing the exact same thing, putting them together, except he was less successful. He only put up four or five of them, I think maybe five, four or five. He set those up, and then also parts of other ones, except he had more parts, which is probably because he wasn't as successful in completing some. So I saw that McCain also would serve the New World Order. Now, this is my interpretation a little bit, so this is not something I got from the dream, but I think that the reason that he was using those folders for schools is because, as we've seen, uh, the, the rich elite bankers, the people who are trying to set up a new world order you know, as, as part of their purpose to control the world, is that they want to get control of everything that is taught to our children. So I believe that those folders were school folders because those, these rule systems that he will put up will be to control what information goes into our children. Okay, now that is, that is part of the New World Order system is that eventually they want all raising of children to be under state control. They don't want parents or family units to raise them at all. That's why they're taking the terms family out of, out of schools and everything else because they want to move everything to total and complete state control. So now what I saw in the next part of the dream was I saw Barack Obama and with him was this other man who looked kind of like him but he had a, a wider jaw and he was maybe a little taller and more gangly. And there was something very strange about this guy. And he had a very close and I think intimate relationship with Barack Obama. Again, this is a man. However, I also see this man uh, dress up as a woman and he goes and sits in on McCain meetings to see what kind of things McCain is saying. And then I see, uh, again, this gangling man at an Obama meeting and he comes outside and there's a woman there who I think is, uh, I, I don't know, some woman who's close to Obama and uh, she's crying and she's upset because she knows what's going on uh, with this other person who's very close to Obama uh, and she says if you if you want them you can have them just just take it I don't care so she's upset and she's just uh, accepting that and then in the last scene I see it's very close to the election and John McCain is preparing his speech except he's acting very strange uh, in the dream I just see him doing some some odd stuff like he's uh, forgetting important details and his behavior is a little off like just all the pins aren't firing correctly. So uh, neither one of these men is, is, a, is a great man for America. And um, uh, you know, I'm, I'm gonna write in Jesus myself. I'm, I'm just gonna write in Jesus. I'm not voting for any of these people. Although I am registered Republican, I'm gonna write in Jesus Christ. That's, that's how my vote's gonna go.